Hello everyone, a very good morning to all. We are back once again. So, we are arranging sometimes to bring fun for you because we love you. So, are you waiting? What? Today's special? Yes, my wonderful people. Today, we are going to learn some interesting topic. So, today's topic is A and M. There are 26 letters in English alphabets. In that, there are 5 vowels. They are A, E, I, O and U. The other 21 letters are called consonants. They are B, C, D, F, G, H, K. Okay. The remaining L, M, M, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, Z. We use a before the word beginning with the consonant sounds. Let's see some examples. I have taken some pictures with the spelling. So the first picture is tomato. The word starts with the T sound. So T is a consonant. So I used here a. As we learn, we use a before a consonant sound. Okay. Now next example is pineapple. The next example is pineapple. So P is a consonant. So here I use a. Next word is cake. Do you like cake? I like so much. Okay. So C. C starts with the consonant. So A I use. It is called a cake. Next word is a girl. She is very cute. Right? So G starts with the consonant. The sound is G. So I use here a girl. Okay. Now next, we use an before a word beginning with the vowel sound. Okay. So let's start some example. An ice cream. The first example is an ice cream. So I is a vowel. Here I use an ice cream. Next is an orange. Again, let me repeat. Orange. So O is a vowel. So I used here A and orange. An orange. Next word is elephant. Next word is elephant. So E is also vowel. So here also I use A and an an. So an elephant. And the last word is umbrella. So umbrella starts with the U. So I used here an umbrella. Okay. I hope you understood. But I want to give you some more uh, example. Because here the sound is very important. Okay. Just keep in mind the sound is very important. So when uh, let me give you some examples. So a house and an R. Just listen it carefully. I said a house and an R. Okay. So both the words start with the little H. But a house, I pronounce a house. So her house. So her we heard. Okay. But in R, I pronounce an R. R. So here you can see the sound. So I say the sound is very important here. So I used an R. So I used here an. So an R. Okay. The H is silent in this pen. So let's see the next example. An uncle and a university. An uncle and a university. Same here I pronounce an uncle. So uncle starts with the U and pronounce like a. a. So I use an but the university I say a university. So the U is pronounced like a U. 
Y O U like Y O U. So I use here a university. I hope you understood. Thank you. Okay, we have seen video before this. So I hope that you understood. So let's start. Uh, what to write in notebook? Okay, so today's word is you have to write today's date and day and then you start with the room. Okay, this room you just write in your notebook. So we use a before a naming word beginning with a consonant sound. Okay, now there are some examples. First line you just write on this room, leave a line and start with the examples. These example word also you have to write in your notebook and then you start with the example. So the first word is bench. Okay, the first word is bench. So the bench word start with the B sound, B sound means it is a consonant. So I use here a bench. The next word pen. P is a consonant, the sound is P. So, again, a pen. Next is T. So, a tree. Next word is dress. So, D is also consonant. So, a dress. Next is as we saw here, B sound the same. So, bus, a bus. Next is van. So, V is also consonant. So, a van. Girl. G. A girl. Again, B. Boy. A boy. Lamb. A lamb. And next is, last one is K. Cut. So, a cut. Root. Okay. So, next root you have to write in a notebook. How I explain how to write consonant root in your notebook? Say, on the next page, you have to write a vowel root. Okay? So, second rule for a vowel, we use and before a naming word beginning with the vowel sound. Okay? Now, the examples are as follows. So, first is egg. What spelling is this? Egg. So, egg spelling word which starts with the E. E is a vowel. So here I used an. Same way read the spelling of, of orange. So O is also vowel. So again here I have written an. Like that you have to read the spellings and write A and an. Or I say use a and here. So, next spelling is ink pot. So, R is also on mobile. So, right here, A and. Then, umbrella, A and. Apple, A and. And apple. Then, again here, ice cream. So, an ice cream. Owl. Then, an owl. Again here, ox, O, so an ox, then elephant, so an elephant, and the last word is ant. So again, A is a vowel, so A and ant. Let me repeat for you, this everything you have to write in a notebook. First rule for functional and a second rule for a vowel, okay? So ant A. And orange and ink pot and umbrella and apple and ice cream and owl and ox and elephant and an ant and ant. Thank you. But everything you just write in a proper way. Okay? Thank you.